what to do. This game's doing a great job at atmosphere, though. Aren't you guys loving it? Some Halloween themed horror gaming. Only with Kale Achievements. Actually, probably with a lot of other guys, too. But, uh. Yeah. Nice. Unless you can, like, keep refilling your lantern. How am I gonna get out of here? <coughs> oh, so you can push these out of the way. Oh, that's awesome. I can push barrels. I mean, boulders. Seem to have gotten it kind of stuck. Okay, whew. Don't want to do that. Holy. Okay, I made it. I'm alive. I'm good. I'm good. Good to go. What's happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Stop. My God, Wilhelm, do something! Accepted. We're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> so they're obviously held captive here. Oh gosh, what are these? Oh my gosh. Looks like a letter from one of the guys here. Wow. So Alexander was a cruel, cruel man, it seems.
So yeah, I got the four chemicals. Aqua Regen. Mementos. Kill by Ryan's and well. I will attempt instead of Aqua Fortis. Okay, good. So it looks like I have the right ingredients. Time to head back to the lab. Looks like it uses like real world settings to dictate the story. Good game so far, great game. Oh my gosh. Oh no, not this again, not this again. What the frig is this crap? It's disgusting. Oh my gosh. Assuming I have to come back here. I swear that was off before. I don't even want to know. I don't even. Okay, so how do we do this here? They must be prepared using the appropriate apparatus. So how the hell do I... Oh, okay, here we go. Um... What the F? I thought there was an enemy. I was about to start freaking out. Okay. Let's turn on the burners first. I hear footsteps. I. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, do I have to do it again now? Alright, fine. I'll do it twice. Sweet. Pot of acid. Let's go use the acid. Oh, what the hell? Ah, <sighs> friggin' hell. Okay, well, we've got to find a way around this. The stairs have collapsed. Find a way to climb back up. Oh, I gotta go through the scary thing. How come it looks like this is just kind of collapsed in? I swear it used to be like a lot more 
messed up. Alright, well, that was my last Tinder. Just give me some time to save my oil. Starting to go crazy. How's my sanity doing? A few cuts and bruises, just a slight headache. Hmm. It's probably not even close to there, is it? What to do? Hmm. can use objects to reach hard to get places. Ah, that was awesome. Oh gosh, no, not this again. No! No, 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 no! It's. Oh, it's everywhere, man. This friggin' acid shit. Okay. Looks like I am ready to explore that way, but, like, I am afraid, so I'd rather go be afraid while getting rid of this bullcrap acid thing. Oh yeah. Woo. Okay, acid down. Now to the refinery. I'm a little bit afraid. Oh, and I'm out of tinder boxes. Perfect. Friggin' perfect. It sure is dark in here. Yes. And there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. I need a tinderbox or something. Crouching in the darkness makes you a lot harder to spot. What enemies are in here? Oh gosh. Okay, well. Gonna look at him. The flicker, the bluish light. Got some oil. Feeling good. Feeling good. I just wish I had a tinder box. So a tinder box would be pretty sweet right now. Ah, uh, crap. Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? 22nd of June, 1839. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it 
lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Well, that's interesting. Like, I don't really know where I'm going, but... Yeah, this little building in the back room is blocked off. That's where the enemy was. I don't want to go there. Yes! Oh my goodness, I'm on a roll with tinderboxes. I don't know, should I like that? I don't know if I should. Your sign is dangerously low. Oh, it's just an ellipse. Twenty fifth of June, eighteen thirty nine. I feel the need to continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care, and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself, like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. Okay, well, still continuing. I'm insane right now in my amnesia, the dark descent will walk through. It's really hard to move now because of the low sanity. Like, really slow. Still being blocked on the other side. 